In deep ocean, far from the public eye, ships are notorious for dumping their bilge tanks. It's shocking and illegal. Located at the bottom of the ship, bilge tanks store liquid waste, rain, water, oil, diesel, detergents, and chemicals. All ships are allowed to throw some garbage overboard as long as they're more than 25 miles from shore. But Emma doesn't throw anything over the side. She stores all her garbage on board. Dumping bilge or garbage is a huge environmental problem. But the carbon emissions that ships pump into the atmosphere is an even bigger worry. In fact, commercial shipping is responsible for releasing more carbon into the air than trucks and jets combined. Except for Emma. She has one of the biggest diesel engines in the world. But she is more fuel efficient and emits less exhaust than a vessel half her size. When they built this big ship, they built her eco-friendly. She's got one of the most unique state-of-the-art waste heat recovery systems in the world. The system recycles the massive amount of gas the engine exhausts out, mixes it with fresh air, and then sends it back into the engine to be reused. Recycling exhaust gases can save up to 10% of the engine's power. That's enough energy for 5,000 homes. In the engine room, Michael and Cadet Anders Mortensen monitor the system. As you can see here, we are running with a 7.3% waste heat recovery. And of course, that reduces our fuel considerably. It results in you are able to throttle down. OK, so it's only a better fuel economy. Yes, you are improving on the fuel economy. You could say that uh, we are operating the vessel very green here. Emma's carbon footprint is made even smaller by the silicone coating on her hull. It's new, and it makes her so streamlined that she saves another 1,200 tons of fuel every year. A jumbo jet carrying the same weight as Emma would travel only half a mile. Using the same amount of fuel, Emma could travel 66. And this big ship holds a lot more than a jet. She's carrying 12,000 containers. The last generation of container vessel was able to carry 7,000 containers. Their fuel consumption is a little bit lesser than ours, but not as much as we can carry almost twice the cargo.